my job is the funnest job. Like I get to think of really cool things for people to do, things you would never associate with a library. So today we have drone movie making. Teens are gonna fly drones with cameras, then they're gonna be able to edit their film together to create mini clips and movies. Most of them have never actually even seen a drone, played with a drone, so it's a new experience for them. And then to be able to look at the computer and see the footage that your drone has taken, that's where their eyes light up. If you talk to anyone, they're like, oh yeah, libraries have books, that's what they're good for. And it's like, no, we have crazy things that go on here at the library. We check out Fitbits and Chromebooks and iPads. We have video games. We do children's, teen and adult programming. We try and hit the whole spectrum for everybody. I like to think of things that we can do that are different and experience technologies that you might not be able to try. You've all learned a lot throughout this last week. Python programming for kids is one of the examples of, I think, a trend that libraries are moving to, which is teens teaching younger kids about STEM initiatives. He is going to teach them how to use Python, which is basic coding for them. They all have their laptops out, they're excited, they're learning things that they don't necessarily get to do in school, and it's in a fun environment where you don't feel intimidated like a teacher is teaching you. This is like, oh, this guy's just kind of cool. Open up this file folder down here. So not everyone can afford a drone. Not everyone gets to play with those in their life. But when you come to the library, you get to try something new like a drone and mix it with video editing to create an experience that you've never done before. And you're gonna put them in here into your video section. That feeling of just excitement at the library is not exactly what you would technically see if we just had books, so it's a lot of fun. See the artistic flair that you've brought here? <laughs> Ah, yes, your tongue, quite masterful in its presentation on the camera. <laughs> we have a teen here and he was struggling at home. And he said, you know, uh, I'm like Harry Potter and my friend is like Hermione and my other friend is like Ron, but the library is my Hogwarts and Angela is my Dumbledore. And for me, that just really stuck about what libraries and the impact we can make stay with teens forever. I wouldn't be doing this job if I didn't think you could change the world. Like, if we could change our title from librarians to world changers, we would do it in a heartbeat. <laughs>